Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a day in the life in Cambodia during rainy season. I love you. It's so good. This guy's been teething. So we're getting ready to go on a walk in. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my channel is all about being a mom, homeschooling, and living overseas. Being a mom can be really hard, but it also can be really rewarding. It can be crazy, but it also can be a lot of fun. So my goal with this channel is to connect with you guys and to be an encouragement to y'all and to do life together. So it's summer break right now. We don't have to do any homeschool today. Um, it's rainy season here in Cambodia. So sometime during the day, it usually rains anywhere from like 30 minutes for really hard to sometimes it rains several hours, but then it's more of a gentle rain. Um, we live here in the city, and so we end up with a lot of flooding because the drainage system is not very good, and the sewer system is just kind of open. So what happens is the streets flood quickly because the water can't drain away fast enough, and then the open sewer mixes in with it, and so it's really gross. So during rainy season, um, when the streets flood, we either just stay home, kind of like a snowstorm in the States. <laughs> we stay home so we don't have to drive through that yucky sewer. Or if we go away, we're, we just take special precautions to clean up and stuff. Um, here in Cambodia, it's known that during rainy season, it's also people tend to get sick easier. And I think it probably has a lot to do with that, the sewer system. So right now, it's been raining like late afternoon, early evening, and sometimes during the night. And then during the daytime, um, it's just hot and sunny. <laughs> right like Cambodia always is, very humid. So anyway, it's morning and I am sticking some laundry in the washer back here. I'm gonna stick some laundry in there and then I got dry laundry I need to take down. So yeah, we'll see you guys after bed again. Oh, I wanted to tell you guys, we are gonna have pork and rice for breakfast. We normally eat scrambled eggs. Um, we would eat cereal, but cereal here is just expensive. And this morning we decided to get the local breakfast, which is pork and rice. So I'll give you guys a glimpse of that. It's really good. And when we go to the States, it's one of the things we always miss and when we have visitors come visit, it's one of the first things they talk about missing when they go back is the pork and rice. So they grill the pork, they marinate it, and then they grill it on these little grills beside the road. And throughout the city, you can see little puffs of smoke coming up in the morning and it's different people grilling their pork. It smells so good as you drive by, especially you drive by like in a, a motorbike or like a tuk-tuk, which is like open air transportation, so you can really smell it. Um, it smells really good, it smells like Cambodia. And then um, eat it with rice, and then often a lot of times we eat it with a fried duck egg, and you can get a bag of clear broth, like vegetable broth, and pour that over it to make it a little bit more moist for the rice. And it is so good, it's so flavorful. Um, on the side, you can also get a little baggie of pickled veggies that are a little bit spicy, a little bit vinegary, and it's really good to eat with your rice, it adds a lot of flavor. And then also we love to drink iced coffee, Cambodian style, which is a, a shot of espresso, really strong, and then put it over ice and add milk. Um, if you get it on the street, they add sweetened condensed milk. I don't like that. I prefer just to add sugar or my own sweetener of choice. Um, and then some milk and drink it that way. It's cold and refreshing on a hot day. All right, so we're down here in the kitchen now, and I got Kaden, he's awake. This guy's been teething. He's been running a low grade fever, but this morning he feels a lot better. Hopefully he won't have a fever today. Anyway, here's our breakfast. And this is how it is in a to-go bag. It's got everything in there you need. And the best thing about this pork and rice is that the one meal only costs one dollar per person. So it makes it taste twice as good. You ready to eat breakfast? Hmm? So here's what the pork and rice looks like. It's so good. <laughs> this here is the bag of pickled veggies. All right, so I got my iced coffee made here and it should be good. Dewey is back there. Our sink has been not draining properly, and so he's gonna pour some Drano down it and see if we can get it working right. Hopefully that will help. These guys are having fun playing Legos. What are you guys building? I'm building a Jeep. A Jeep? That's a pretty cool Jeep you're building, Zeke. Zadok, what are you gonna build? I build, I build, I build, I build this, this, and I'm building a Lego. Oh, okay. 
Okay, cool. Hey Creed, what are you playing? What are you playing? I'm playing Discouse. Oh, that looks like fun. So Dewey dumped Reno down the sink and it ate through the cheap plumbing and all came out on the floor. So we had a big, about inch thick of Drano on the floor down there that he's cleaning out now. That was a pain and a mess. So it, since the Drano ate right through the pipe, we're gonna have to get a whole new plumbing in front of the sink. Dewey says he doesn't like plumbing here because you, to fix one tiny thing, you end up having to fix a whole bunch of things <laughs> every time. Caden is almost sleeping. Okay, so I am in here with our computer now and I'm going to work on making a planner. I'm trying to make a planner for our homeschool um, year and I mix it with my YouTube planner to plan videos and do collabs and stuff. And so I'm using Excel and if I get stuck, get my husband to help me. He knows a lot more about it than I do and it's really fun. It's a fun creative outlet for me. I enjoy making it. And I'll be doing a video showing you guys my planner for our homeschool and for my YouTube and that video will go up towards the beginning of July. Hey guys, so I'm checking in with you guys again. It is now late afternoon or early evening. Um, traffic is pretty busy on the road. Everybody's going home from work. Dewey was doing some work-related projects today and I was here at home taking care of the boys and working on that planner for a bit. Caden has been kind of fussy. He's teething and so it's just been a day of holding him and cuddling him a lot. So I'm gonna start on supper prep this evening and I think we're gonna go on a walk around our neighborhood and see if some of our neighbors are out. I really enjoy going on a walk around our neighborhood in the evening because usually the families are all coming home from work, they're all in a good mood, you know, they're done with their work for the day, it's time to relax, the air is starting to cool off a little bit and there's a lot of people often out walking around our block exercising and stuff and so it's nice to go out and just talk with them and get a little exercise after the heat of the day. Oh, and I should show you guys, Dewey did get the sink fixed, the drain fixed today, in between working on other projects. It looks nice and clean in here. It looks a lot better than what it did earlier. This here is a water filter system that Dewey put in because the tap water isn't that safe to drink here. This is a filter system for us. That's why we have two faucets. So this is just like normal tap water, and this one is the filtered water that we can drink. But it's not cold. It's just all of it is just like lukewarm. So you can hear my neighbors out the back door here talking. But I am working on supper, I'm making mac and cheese, I got macaroni boiling in there, and I'm making oatmeal bars. I'm melting the peanut butter, honey, and butter together there to make oatmeal, like granola bars. And I'm out of meat in my freezer, and it's too late in the day to go to market. I don't like to go this late after the meat has sat in the sun all day. So we are just going to use this to go with our mac and cheese tonight. The boys will be happy, they love this stuff. And we'll probably just use like half of it and save half of it for another time, since it is a little bit expensive. What creed? Okay, just you'll get food just a minute. So this is our supper time now. We're eating supper. We got the mac and cheese and the spam there and the lettuce. So it should be a good supper. Granola bars are almost done too. All right, so we're getting ready to go on a walk here. Got the three boys. They've got their shoes on. It's really windy. I think it's getting ready to rain. Dewey pulled the car in quick and it's locking up. We're gonna try to quick go on a walk before it rains. You found a rock. Yeah. Creed is all into collecting rocks. See, there's a bunch of people out exercising, kids playing.
Caden's stroller is reclining slightly, but Caden's sitting way front. He wants to sit front and see the world. Yep, there's the shortcut. Well, we're gonna go. We're gonna go this way. Okay, jump down. Come on, we gotta go catch up to Dad. You wanna hold my hand? Okay, jump. Woo, good job. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and comment down below in the comment section. If you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button as it helps me out and encourages me to keep making videos. So yeah, thanks for watching, bye.